I got this PC from my grandparents right before it was going to be taken to the dump. The reason was because of a failed hard drive which was 40 megabytes in capacity. Yes, not 40 gigabytes, 40 megabytes. The PC is still usable however, using DOS 3.1 I am able to run games from floppy disks no problem. The startup is the culmination of systematic checks on aspects of the computer's hardware, such as the processor and RAM. Of course, the hard drive is not affected. For some context, this specific DOS machine was made by Olivetti and it features an Intel 386SX processor, 8MB of RAM which was upgraded from 1MB and an added MAF coprocessor. Due to the original hard drive failure, everything must be booted from a 3.5 inch floppy disk which is painfully slow for games. This causes lag and lower overall frame rates. I aim to either replace the whole motherboard or the hard drive as the problem could be with the internal IDE bus on the motherboard. This demonstration will show just how slow the loading is from the floppy disk. Please take into account that the following game is copyrighted by Alkalade Software and all content in this game is owned by them. I am using this content in a constructive manner to demonstrate the speed of a floppy disk. As you can see, the game took a long time to load and did not utilise the highly specced DOS hardware. This is part of the reason why I want to get a functioning hard drive so that I can play these classics at better frame rates. The game, despite the floppy disk, does run well on this machine and it is definitely playable to say the least. For a first person shooter, Wolfenstein 3D is a great DOS based game to play on these old PCs and it's still a whole load of fun despite how bad I am. The combination of a classic beige keyboard and the floppy disk usability makes this 1991 PC authentic for the classic gamer. Thank you for watching Adam Maddatech and my overview of this Olivetti DOS based PC from 1991. If you want to see more videos like this, like and share this video. If you like my content, feel free to subscribe and to comment new video ideas. Join me next Wednesday on the 11th of July for my overview of the Windows XP netbook.